easy one to get your head around. We're going to move backwards. People say you can't hit uh, on the retriever back and up. You can if you're isolating your motion each time out. Meaning, when I have Werner here, same one. Jab, jab, cross, jab, cross, lead hook, jab, cross, lead hook, rear upper cut. But what's going to happen? I step to him, he steps back, lost his stance. Boom. I step to him, he steps back, lost. Uh, two. That's all right, you're fine. Step back. I step to him, step back. Two, three, four, and hit it. Beautiful. That's the drill. That makes sense? So, into your person, and then that, you don't let them step back. So, I mean, the drill. He doesn't step back. Go ahead, step back. That's not what I want. I want this. I want to step to him. He has to step back. sense he only gets to move because I'm moving and he's not and notice what he's not doing is this he's not stepping that foot's in the air even it's a millimeter uh, at the same time he's here sit he's in he's in good base so every single time I can watch every single one of you on video every punch that comes out should look like your feeder here and we were talking earlier about I think that this past week about watching fighters in the feet if you're watching anyone throw against the pads to the bag you see this. Even if it's just light up under the toes and all this, you get no. Let's let's start this again. And often, if it's bad, just standing still is really, really shitty when people are walking around. Okay, is this? Mm -hmm. So let's do this as a retreat drill. Exact same combination. Okay. 